Hey guys, Brian Forstall, Free to Be TV. I want to do uh, lesson three uh, in the simple beginner series, section one. Um, basically, we're going to be learning how to add from that D chord, how to put the D suspended four to D, uh, back to D, D add nine, and then back to D again. Um, so it's going to be like having your D. So let's get right down to it. If you've got your D chord, which you should have learned in lesson two, um, basically, uh, your first finger is going to go in the second fret on string three. Your middle finger is going to go in the same fret, fret two on string one. And it's really arched up and down. This is a tough chord. Then your third finger comes into the second string on the third fret on the second string. That's your D. Now, to make it suspended, you take your pinky and you add it right underneath your third finger in the same fret, fret three. That's a G note. That makes D suspended fourth. You lift that pinky back off, you're back to D. Then we lift the middle finger off, and that opens the first string. Adds the ninth note at E up there. D add nine. And then you go back by putting the second finger back on the first. And you've got back to the D chord, okay? So you got D, D suspended four, back to D, D add nine, and then you're back to D, okay? And then with the chords we've learned, C, G, E minor and the D, and now these chords, you have like a uh, Guns N' Roses type of thing, like a set a woman, take it slow, and work itself out fine. Well, all we need is just a little patience. Set sugar, take the time, cause the lights are shining bright. All we need is just a little patience. Oh, yeah. A little patience. Now, with just those chords, you should be able to put together a lot of songs. You know, I can think of Knocking on Heaven's Door to um, a thousand others about a girl. You know. Real quickly, that sequence for uh, the Guns N' Roses thing was a C chord with the down, 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 up, down, up rhythm I showed you on the two previous lessons. Then you go to G, back to C, then the E minor, then C, to G, to D, and then the D chords I've showed you, D suspended, back to D, D add 9, and back to D, and those all get one strum in the end. So the D gets the full rhythm, and then one, 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 one. Set sugar, take the time. Hope that works out great for you guys. I hope you learned a lot. Don't forget, there's probably a million songs and just a few chords I've shown you. So go on to Ultimate Guitar uh, Archive or something. Look up uh, Google Guitar Tabs, uh, Google Guitar Chords, and there'll probably be thousands of songs that you can learn with just the handful of chords I've already shown you. And um, I'll see you in lesson four. Thank you so much. God bless. Have a great day.